design studio with the name of Modelo Architects and Interiors. I myself am a graduate of National College of Arts, graduated in year 2001. I am running my own firm for the last 15 years and we are working all over the country but majorly in Punjab. We are involved in all sorts of projects like residential, commercial and uh, interiors. Our primary focus in design is towards the architecture projects which we do and which we try to create for our clients. Sensitivity, I would say. Being sensitive to your surrounding, to your environment, to the client's requirement is the primary design initiative in my work. Purity. Simplicity and purity in the form and in design mostly dominate my work. I try to be more uh, simple and pure in my ideas and thoughts, whatever the project requirement is. I would say aesthetics, comfort, and then modernity. I feel every designer is different from each other and the differentiating factor being the eye. It's how you perceive the world, it's how you perceive your environment and surroundings. That what is reflected in your work later on and that's what makes you different from each other. A lot of people inspire me. I take inspiration from people from all walks of life. For example, I take inspiration from a master carpenter who is very skilled at his job or maybe a swirling dervish who has uh, pure form of motion. I would like to be remembered for the passion in my work which is depicted in my projects. Yes, I am very much concerned about creating a sustainable design and architecture for my clients. But unfortunately we are way behind uh, in delivering what is required as per as our environment demands at the moment. This can be because of lack of awareness about this uh, alarming situation worldwide among our clients and among our society. I believe we as architects have a huge responsibility to create this uh, awareness among our clients. Innovation in design worldwide is being dominated by technology these days. I believe the rapidly changing technology in our urban fabric, in, the, in our society, is playing a major role in defining what uh, our design principles would be. For that, we have to keep up with the changes in technology worldwide. Unfortunately, in our society, in our country, we are not up to date with all the latest tech methods which are involved in the field of architecture and interior design. But uh, sooner or later, we have to come up to the level, otherwise we would be way behind. But again, the design these days is led by technology. 